answers. I'd like you to review that. And uh, next problem here. Here in this case, when you look at the first two equations, you see uh, y is missing. Okay. So if I look at the first equation here, and the second, uh, if I pick the first one, x minus y is equal to 4z, and then if I pick the first one and the last one and eliminate the y, just by mo if I see the coefficient of y here is uh, negative 1, coefficient of y here is 4, if I multiply the top row here by 4, I can eliminate the y easily. So I get one equation in terms of x and z, and then look at the second line is, is in terms of x and z. So now you get yourself two equations and two unknown in terms of x and z so you can solve for. So I would let you uh, look at these solutions since we only have five minutes to the end of this session. And then uh, next meeting, next 